potato is one versatile ingredient when it comes to making snacks. Today's recipe is a super crisp aloo tikki or aloo patties. It is very popular Indian street food enjoyed as an evening snack. Crispiest aloo tikki tips coming right up. Hi, this is Mano and you're watching Mano Cooks. Take 5 boiled potato. Tip number 1. Boil potato the previous day and keep it in fridge. Mash it or grate it. Now add ginger paste, red chilli powder and turmeric powder, garam masala, red chilli flakes and one finely chopped green chilli, chaat masala, salt, coriander powder and jeera powder, finely chopped coriander leaves, breadcrumbs, rice flour, Tip number 2. If you don't have breadcrumbs, add corn flour or add soaked poha or add suji or rava. Now mix everything with hand until well combined. Grease hand with little oil and let's make them into tight balls and then give the shape of tikki as how I am doing it right here. If this seems difficult for you, please take a cookie cutter or a lid and grease it and shape the balls pressing inside that and take them out. You should be done. If you are new to my channel, please click on the subscribe button and click on the bell icon. And please do comment me if you find this recipe simple and easy. Sharing is caring. Please share Mano Cooks on your social media. Please watch the full video for all the tips. Repeat the same with all the mashed potato mixture. Now keep everything in a plate. Take some corn flour on a plate. Coat all tikkis with corn flour. Tip number 3. If you have time, dust them with corn flour and keep the patties in the fridge for 30 minutes before frying them. You can skip this if you don't have time. So let's heat oil in medium high. Once oil is heated enough, let's slowly slide in the patties one by one. You can shallow fry or fry it on a pan or brush both sides of tikki in oil and bake it in 180 degree C for 15 to 20 minutes until you see them turn golden brown both the sides. Tip number 4. Always fry one side first and then turn and fry the other side. Tip number 5. Please use a small spoon to turn the tikki. Do not use big ladle as they might break the other tikki. One batch took me 7 minutes together for both the sides. Please fry it until you see both sides turn crispy golden brown color. Now repeat the same with all the batches. The previous batch was dusted with corn flour and now I am showing the ones that are not dusted with corn flour. But both of them turned out equally yummy and crispy. I am very sure that these crispy aloo patties would be the new favorite snack at your home. Please serve it in a plate with your choice of spicy green chutney or tomato ketchup. Sprinkle some chaat masala and a dash of lemon juice and the most amazing street food style no fail crispiest alu tikki right in your plate. This could be a great lockdown snack option for the entire family especially with just one main ingredient. Please watch my other videos and do subscribe, like and share and comment for more such good recipes. Thanks for watching.